many students dedicate Many students dedicate their lives to their education, but one Elon student is dedicating his life to his country. We talked with this student Saturday to find out what inspires him. It's just, it's just a part of my, my family, it's a part of who I am. Elon Sr. and ROTC Cadet First Lieutenant DeMarco Crum worked with other ROTC members to bring Wounded Warriors from Fort Bragg to Elon on Saturday. Wounded Warriors is a program created by the military to help veterans who suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder or other physical injuries to readjust to the real world. Jeff Burnell has been in the program for two years and he appreciates the break from the base. On well, trips like we have today to get people out and about away from uh, the medical stuff for a little bit, so kind of clear their minds. And Crum says bringing them here was more inspiring than he imagined. And now I'm starting to get closer to where I start to see them as not peers, but more so just people to look look up to, so that I can hope to reach their level, and uh, just just to uh, to serve my country the way they have. Crum's mom is still on active duty. He says growing up in a military family shaped his life. Uh, just serving the military, I think, is my way of just giving back. But there's something that scares him. He knows that one day he could end up with PTSD, emotionally wounded like many of the veterans here. I mean, I think about it a lot. I mean, I definitely, because I know a lot of people that have, uh, that have suffered problems from it, both psychological and physical, but I'm, uh, it's, it's a risk I'm willing to take for, uh, for the country. He thanks God every night his mom is still safe, and he says, though it's scary, the desire to serve his country outweighs his fears. I love this country, and... I'm I'm willing to I'm willing to put my life on the line for it. So it's uh, you know, it, that, that's just as simple as that. For more information about the Wounded Warriors Project, visit our website at www.phoenix14news.wordpress.com.